Okay, we're going to do a couple of tutorial videos here today uh, regarding PDO Quote. Uh, the first one we're going to do is the setup of the country and the company codes and everything else. So this is when you first get your phone. First thing you will do is move across into your phone settings. Go into your phone settings and you'll find PDO Quote in your settings menu. Tap on that. And it gives us a list here of company names, etc, etc. Now what this is, is this is your own personal company details. So we'll, first of all, we'll start by filling out some of these fields. I'll call it President and whatever. What I'm doing here is obviously just filling out my tax or any other sort of information that needs to be available on the actual invoice or quote. Okay, now I come down here to my country's preferences. Uh, tax code used, it gives me a list. If I go in through here, it gives me a list of the most common tax codes used throughout the world. Uh, you can either just use tax as well, which is there in my country here in Australia. We've got GST. So I'll leave it at that. And my preferences is kilometers. My name. Now that shows at the bottom of the quote. Now this is handy for if there's multiple people using PDR quote. Put your names on them obviously. I'll show you that on the final invoice very shortly. Email all documents too. Now this is handy if you want to email all your invoices and quotes back to a home base. Saves you filling out that email address each time. You can just put it in here and all emails, everything will go through. So let's say Shane at home base. The this isn't a real address so don't bother sending me stuff there. Okay, saving options. I'm going to save as a JPEG as well as a PDF in these tutorials just to show you what's going on, but you can turn this off. Set repair prices. Hit set repair prices. Now this comes into a new field. What this is, is obviously you can set it up to whatever you want. You get three options when you look at your repair prices, light, medium or heavy. Uh, you can set them to however you feel. So I'll just quickly go through, just do a very quick. And you can set these up to be car yard prices, insurance prices, whatever you may. In Australia, we've got different insurance companies which have different insurance prices, but let's say that there's a, um, a hail disaster somewhere, well, what we'll do is obviously set all our phones up to be whatever the uh, standard is for that insurance company and it saves a lot of time turret sedan and turret wagon please don't take too much notice to these prices these are just coming straight off the top of my head Ugh. in for us proofing all right so once that's all done that is mainly our settings menu so uh, as you can see we've got quite a few options here and we can come in and change these at any time but uh, basically what you want to do once you first get your phone just want to make sure that you come in here and at least set your company details in here because obviously without those company details the invoice or quote will be incomplete okay so that just about does it for this tutorial and it's pretty straightforward it's just a settings menu uh, we will refer back to this this is called a settings menu so every, each time I do say that in different tutorials this is the area that 
uh, we are speaking about. Okay, Let's see how we go.